back to the kind of values question, I'll just tell you a story from a focus group that I did last year where we were asking people, um, you know, why do you want things to be bipartisan? Why do you think that it's important if there is somebody from both sides of the aisle on a bill? And they said, well, it's because different the different parties bring something different, and neither one of them have it figured out. And so if they've both come onto this thing, it's probably okay. And they told this great story. <laughs> this woman said, you know, it's like if my kid needs a new pair of shoes. If I ask the Democrats, can I have a new pair of shoes? They'll say, that's awesome. Do you want seven pairs of shoes? Should they be Nike pumps? Like, we really got to get the best shoes that have ever happened, the most expensive, top of the line shoes. And I think probably we need to get them six or seven pairs. The Republicans will say, no, no shoes. You don't get any shoes. Wear plastic bags. And they're like, the kid needs a pair of Keds. Can we get to a pair of Keds? And that's why I like bipartisanship, because generally they will agree on a pair of Keds. So I think that goes to one of the kind of values things that, that Democrats need to start communicating, which is that we're not trying to buy a new pair of shoes for everybody in the country, or seven or eight of the most expensive kinds of shoes. And doubling down on free college for everyone and extra things is not the way to do that. <laughs> if that's the problem with the Democratic brand, then things like free college actually make it worse.